the video for you, my patient who has some hip trochanteric pubic symphysis pain. I just showed you three stretches, one exercise to help all that out. I know you're going to forget the vast majority of it, so here's your review tape. All right, so we'll start off with the three stretches that I showed you. One was just a basic spinal twist. You're going to lie down on the floor. Reach across your body. Grab your knee. Pull it across. You're going to focus on bringing that knee up as it goes down. Keep your eye on your other hand. Hold this for upwards of 30 seconds. Switch sides. You can cycle through this three to five times, depending on how long you're holding it. That should only take you two, three minutes to get through that component of it. The next move I showed you was focused a little bit more on your glute medius. It starts out very familiar to a, a thread the needle kind of stretch where you reach through on piriformis. But I might do this more for glute medius, so slide that down to expose a little bit more of that glute medius tissue. And then you're going to do it very similarly to a thread the needle there. You can do this with a post isometric relaxation by pushing in, then relaxing back, pushing in, relaxing back, or you can just camp out in there if it's already hitting right here. The third stretch I showed you, come on back, is that box stretch. You can get up on a box, a stool, a chair, or whatever, and just pull your pelvis into neutral. Keep your spine straight. Drop your hips. Those are your three stretches. The one strengthening component I showed you was um, focused on internal rotation of your femur. The way I had you do that was I had you come to the edge of an anything, bring your knee to a 90 degree, 90 degree, pretend that this has a laser pointer and you don't want the point to move at all, or a rotisserie, and then you're going to articulate your foot down, not letting your knee come up as you do so, and then bring your foot up, not letting your knee flex at the hip, or go, get low. See, what you do is this. You like to extend your hip a little bit as the foot comes up. Really try to fight that off. There. Now, as I told you, you can do that between 8 and 12 times for as many as three rounds. You could go through stretch one, stretch two, stretch three, one set. That's one cycle. You could go through that three times. I'm going to see you in a week. I'm going to see you practicing.